So hey my YouTubers and everyone in the world, today is June the 10th, the time is now 4.48 p.m. guys. Today was a beautiful Monday, but it's kind of rainy, so, but it was still a good Monday. Moving forward, if you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below and that notification bell so you can see more of me. Now, today's topic is going to be 14 things you must give up in order to be happy. In order to be happy, you got to give up certain things that you're currently doing right now. And you know what? Some of the things that I'm about to mention, even I'm a little guilty of. So do not feel bad if I mention quite a few things that you guys need to give up because it just means that we need to work on ourselves a lot better. So the first thing you must give up in order to be happy, guys, is give up your need to always be right. There are going to be times in our lives where we are not right. Like sometimes that just happens. You're not always going to be right. You're not always going to know everything. And you have to learn to accept that. It is a part of life. Every day is a new day for us to learn something new. There's going to be things that we, we are not too sure of. We think we might know, but we really don't. So yes, give up the need to always be right. The second thing you must give up in order to be happy, guys, is give up your need for control. And I'm going to say that again. You got to give up the need to control every aspect of your life. There's no possible way that you can control everything that's going on in your life. It's just not reality. So when you start to realize that you, you are not going to always be in control of every situation, sometimes, you know what, it's, it's a growing process and it's a part of life. There's going to be times where things are going to happen that's out of our control and all we can do is roll with the punches of things. So work on yourself if you always feel the need to be in control of every aspect of your life because that is not a good thing. The third thing we need to give up in order to be happy, guys, is we need to give up blaming other people. If you know that you are wrong for doing certain things or whatever the case may be, then it's up to you as an adult to start being responsible enough to say, okay, I was wrong for certain things that I did. But always blaming someone else, that's not responsible. You got to give up that blaming other people and start looking at yourself and seeing what, what part of you caused that situation to possibly take place. Now, the fifth thing that you need to start giving up in order to be happy, guys, is give up negative thinking. Yes, give up negative thinking because negative thinking will only lead to more negative situations and thinking in your life. So give up the negative thinking. When you start to feel yourself thinking negative thoughts, convert to something more positive because negative thinking will hold you back. It will not help you to grow in a positive way. Now, the fifth thing that we need to start giving up in order to be happy, guys, is give up your limiting beliefs. See, honestly speaking, guys, we put limitations on ourselves and that is the problem. That's why I'm telling you guys, it's really important for you to stop putting limitations on your own life. Just because certain things may not have worked out for someone else does not necessarily mean it won't work out for you. So be more positive when you are approaching, when you are um, in the process of accomplishing your goals or no matter what it is that you want to accomplish in your life is possible, but it all starts in your mind. So do not put limitations on what's possible for your life, no matter what anyone else has to say about it. Now, the sixth thing that you need to give up in order to be happy, guys, is give up complaining. 80% of the people that you complain to don't care, and the other 20% is glad it's you. So give up complaining because complaining is it, it doesn't help the situation at all. You know, find solutions to whatever your problem is. And like I always tell you guys, to every one problem, there's four or five solutions. You know, so give up complaining because it's not helping you. And it's going to make you happier once you start to let these things go. Now, the seventh thing you have to give up, guys, in order to be happy is you got to give up the luxury of criticism. Like, don't be so, don't criticize so much. You know, none of us on earth are perfect. But at the end of the day, you have some people that look at people and criticize them and the way that they dress. You criticize things you don't understand, and it shows true ignorance. So like I just said before, give up the luxury of criticism. Do not criticize. Be as open-minded as you possibly can. 
not everyone is going to be the same. Not everyone is going to look the same. Not everyone is going to have the same personality or attitude. Sometimes people might do things that you may not understand. And some people may see it as strange. Other people may see it as, you know, weird or whatever the case may be. But stop criticizing because you may do things sometimes that people don't understand. And if someone criticized you and says something negative about you, it will make you feel bad. So take that into account. Now, the seven, the eight, no, the eighth thing that you need to do in order to be happy, guys, is give up the need to impress others. And I feel like this is something that a lot of people definitely need to work on. You know, give up the need to impress others. When you do something, do it because it makes you happy. Do it because it makes you feel good. Do it because you want to do it. You know, whether, no matter how you dress, your personality, your attitude, whatever you're doing, do it for you. Don't do it to help, you know, to please other people. Because let me tell you something, people are always going to have something to say. And that is just the reality of life. So if you start focusing more on pleasing yourself, it'll make you a lot happier. And I had to learn that too. Like, I do things to make myself happy now, not to please other people. If people are happy for me then cool, thumbs up. Other than that, it is what it is. Now, the ninth thing that you have to give up in order to be happy, guys, is you got to give up the resistance to change. Like change is going to happen. Like I always say, guys, with time comes change. So you have to learn to adapt to change. Don't, don't try to fight change because there's no way to fight whatever's going to happen. So like I said, give up the resistance when it comes to change, because change is going to happen, and it's just that simple. So you have to roll with the punches of life and keep moving forward. Now, the 10th thing that you got to give up in order to be happy, guys, is give up on your fears. Whatever fears you have, learn to face them, because as long as these fears are in the back of your mind, you're always going to bring forth your fear. Like if a person is, is, is afraid of snakes, they're going to bring forth those things that they're afraid of. They're going to have to face that fear at some point in time. And a lot of times the fear is not, it's coming from maybe a tragedy that happened or maybe it's coming from our minds. Our mind is telling us that we're afraid, even if we may not be. And because we believe our minds all the time, that's what makes it even more realistic until we actually fear what it is that we started to fear in our minds. So like I said before, give up on fear because that will hold you back. It's false evidence appearing real. It's not real. Now, the 11th thing that you guys have to give up in order to be happy, guys, is give up on excuses. And I am one to tell you that I cannot stand when people make excuses for this and excuses for that. No, that is not being responsible. Give up on the excuses. Let it go. You really have to because excuses will stagnate you for years and years and years. Oh, the reason why I didn't do this was because of that. Or the reason why I didn't do that was because of this. No. If there's something that you want to do, you have to go out there and make it happen. Don't come up with excuses for why something is not working out. If it's not working out, let it go. Or give it a shot in a different way and see if, if, if that helps. But don't just always have excuses after excuses. That's so lame. Anyways, now, the 12th thing that you guys have to give up on in order to be happier is you got to give up on the past. And I know that this one is like really golden. 12, give up on the past. Past experiences, bad experiences that you had, maybe even traumatic experiences. It takes time to heal, but healing is extremely possible. So at the end of the day, you guys have to give up on the past experiences that you had. Take what you learned from it and continue to move forward. But don't constantly... Um, you know, keep reminding everyone of certain things that happened to you. And because we all have a story, you know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, you got to give up on the, the things that happened in the past. Take the lessons learned behind it and you utilize it to make you better in the near future. But you can't go back and change whatever happened. So you might as well accept it for what it is. Take what you learn from it and use it in a positive way in the near future. But do not keep living in the past because it, it's pointless. You can't go backwards. So you might as well keep moving forward. Now, 
the 13th thing that you guys have to give up on in order to be happier is you got to give up on attachments. And I know that this is something that's extremely difficult because sometimes we get attached to people, to, you know, um, materialistic things, but you have to learn to just like control that attachment. You don't want to get attached to the wrong person and then you end up getting your heart broken or you don't want to get attached to materialistic things and you know something bad happens and now because you don't have it you're lost. Like don't get too attached unless it's like to maybe a goal or something that's positive and productive for your life. That's you know but getting attached to too many things is just to me it's not good. It's just not. Now the 14th, the 14th thing that you guys have to give up in order to be happier is give up living your life based off of other people's expectations. So you, you guys can't live your life to please other people. You guys can't live your life to make other people happy and satisfied. Because as I said before, there's going to be times where people are just not going to be happy because they're not happy in their own lives. You know, so to see you striving for better, it, it kills them. But like I said, you know, you got to live for you, breathe for you and stop trying to please everyone else and make everyone else happy. Because a person who tries to please everyone ends up pleasing no one because people are just like that. So do what works for you. Do what makes you happy, what makes you satisfied, what gives your life some meaning and value and, and work it. I hope that you guys like this video. And if you did, make sure to give this video a huge thumbs up. And like I always say, guys, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And of course, visit my website at shoploveronline.com. Until next time, guys, peace.